Hello Tulip girls and boys. I have another story to read you that um, was one of our very favourite stories when my children were little. Um, we, we were supposed to take it to the barn or the jumble sale but we couldn't because we loved it so much we wanted to keep it forever. So this one is called I Want My Potty and it's by Tony Ross and it's about a little girl learning to use a potty instead of wearing a nappy. Here she is racing to the bathroom and here's when one of my children liked the book so much they drew on it. <clears throat> Here she is with her L plate learning to drive a potty. And here, whoopsie, Teddy, Teddy's fallen into the potty. Nappies are yuck, said the little princess. There must be something better. The pot is the place, said the queen. Does the little princess look keen to use the potty? I see her hiding behind the sofa. At first, the little princess thought the potty was worse. The potty's the place, said the queen. Not a very happy princess. So the little princess had to learn. Sometimes the little princess was a long way away from the potty when she needed it most. More scribbling from one of my kids. Don't you do that on your books at home, tulip girls and boys, because it will be there forever. Sometimes the little princess played tricks on the potty. She's sitting on her crown and she's put the potty on her head. And sometimes the potty played tricks on the little princess. It looks like it slipped and she fell off. Soon the potty was fun and the little princess loved it. Everybody said the little princess was clever and would grow up to be a wonderful queen. Look how clever she is. The potty's the place, said the little princess proudly. Oh, that poor gentleman's having to look and see what she put in the potty. I'm pretty sure it was a number two. One day, the little princess was playing at the top of the castle when I want my potty, she cried. Oh my goodness. Even the teddy bear's surprised. She wants her potty, cried the maid. She wants her potty, cried the king. The king's putting up wallpaper. Whoops, he spilt all the glue. She wants her potty, cried the cook. She wants her potty, cried the gardener. She wants her potty, cried the general. She wants her potty, cried the admiral. So the potty was taken as quickly as possible to the princess. Just a little too late. Oh dear, she didn't make it. She had to, she had to um, wait too long for the potty to come. She was too far away from the potty at the top of the castle to get to the potty in time. Whoopsie daisy. So I hope if any of you are learning to try and use the potty that you could find this a funny story to listen to before you go on have a go. Um, I know my kids loved it. They used to sit on the potty with this book and look at the pictures and it used to make them have a chuckle. Um, I'll come back with another story soon or someone will. Um, lots of love. Bye bye. We miss you. Bye.